My God. My God, my God. It has been a while. <sighs> you guys, the reason why I haven't been doing videos regularly is basically just because my work schedule is so crazy. When I'm not at work, I'm either at the gym trying to get snatched, trying to get, trying to be a rich middle-aged white woman by the time next year I get here. Um, I don't know about the white part. I'm working on it, but um, in the middle-aged part, I still got a while, but the snatch part is coming soon, very much so. But I'm either at the gym, at work, or sleeping, to be completely honest, so I'm out with friends. But mostly at the gym and at work. Um, yeah. So I've been missing a whole bunch of reality shows. I'm I'm still watching Married to Medicine. Have to do my review of that. Um, I'm, I've got to catch up on the Braxtons. Um, I want to do a video on cutting it in the ATL. That comes right on after the Braxtons. About those five women in ATL with the beauty salons, the hot mess. Um, even though it's over with, I still want to just give a video about it. Because it's just funny to me. <coughs> Um, so much has been going on in the world. Bill Cosby has admitted to the, some things, and it's just crazy. Um, anyway, I'll talk about that in another video. Um, to you guys who are watching this video, I'm sorry that I haven't been here. I'm here with you. I love you guys. I'm still here with y'all, but I'm just um, literally booked. Like, And that's just the honest to God truth. Um, I would do videos every day if, if I didn't have anything... If, if I wasn't so busy, because, you know, I just love this. But, um, anyway, Basketball Wives LA is back. Um, now, did I watch second seat the following season? A little bit. Um, but thank God that Sunday Carter is gone. And I like British, but apparently British and Drea had some things going on behind the scenes, and so that's why she's no longer there. But, um, I just, um, I, I have to catch up on the first episode, but I watched the second episode, and it's just crazy. Um, what the hell is it about with, um, Malaysia going on a date with Doug? I guess just to, to get in, in Jackie's mind, to get his perspective on how Jackie is as a person. It's kind of like Jackie's the outsider now and Jackie has to prove to them that she's worthy to be their friend. And, you know, the fact that Jackie's ass is still on the show causing trouble and she's at least 50 or going on 50 is, is quite sad. Um, the thirst is, is incredible. It really, truly is. I honestly thought the Basketball Wives was dead. Like, both of them. Miami and L.A., but I guess not. Um, wow. But I can't wait to see Dammy. Um, and I think Evelyn's gonna make an appearance, too. I don't like Evelyn. But, um, you know, I can't wait to see Tammy on this season. And Shawnee's coming back. Yay! Don't like her, either. But, um, I think I'm gonna try to review this season. It's really funny. Um, it just looks interesting. We have um, a new addition, two new additions to the cast. We have Megan from uh, Bad Girls Club, whatever season it was. I don't know. I remember her old um, triangle face, old, old square face ass. I remember her. Um, and we have this lady named Patrice, Russian rocker, whatever. I don't know her last name. Y'all hit me out in the comments, named Patrice. And she seems really cool. She's Malaysia's friend. Um, she's been with her man for a while. They got a whole herd of kids, like seven. Um, two is not biologically hers, but, um, one of the child's mother's passed and the other one, um, she just decided to take him on or something or I don't know the story. I forgot the story, but, um, yeah, so she's raising that, those kids and, you know, good for her. In Malaysia, you know, she's trying to show them a good time. So she's taking them out or whatever, had a birthday party for them and all that. Um, cause they're new to LA and everything. And it's just crazy. Um, Dre is still snatched. Uh, what I have to say about all these women on the show on basketball wives, LA in particular, all these women are absolutely beautiful. Um, and Jackie's pretty in her own way as well. But all these women are beautiful. I, I will give them that. Every single one of them are gorgeous. You know. So, it's, I don't know. I just wanted to throw that out there for the nostalgia. Um, Drea still snatch. Um, she's still low-key messy and a troublemaker. Won't admit to shit. Um, Malaysia just is 
batshit crazy as ever. You know, she's no longer married. I'm sorry about that, dear. Um, Malaysia decided to take... I'm all over the place, you guys. Just roll with me, please. Um, I decided, um, She decided to take Patrice and her husband and her little boys and all they kids they went out and you know to play ball or whatever in the park and she feel like she's she should have stepped she should have stuck it out like patrice did with her husband but patrice i'm sure took a whole bunch of shit off that man a whole lot i guarantee you he's a basketball player it's just it's just women left and right everywhere you know he took them offers like you know she, imagine how long she, how she stayed through all that mess I guess it was some infidelity issues with Malaysia's husband, so she decided to leave him. I don't know the story. You guys feel me in the comments with that. But um, it's just crazy. Um, oh, what else I was talking about? Oh, Jackie, she had um com a commercial either for her alcohol or for some panty line or for the dildo line, and her and Doug got together. I don't know what the hell it was. But anyway, um, Megan ended up showing up. She had invited somebody there, one of her models or something, they didn't show up, so she de decided to have Megan in the commercial. Megan, um, strong face ass, was more than happy to get into the mix. Um, and she ain't been knowing Jackie no longer than two damn minutes. Um, as, as much as I done seen Santa Claus, that's as long as um, Jackie done known Megan, which is never. So, um, they at the video shoot and she pulls out this big snake and you know both Jackie and Megan is comfortable holding this big ass snake which is I'm sure um so Jackie so um Jackie and Megan you know they was doing their thing and then Patrice walks in now Patrice is Malaysia's friend nobody really knows Patrice Patrice has met the girls before but nobody really knows Patrice and Megan she was like why is she here isn't she Malaysia's friend like why is she here they pretty much just started talking and Megan came over, you know, just being real messy. And, you know, I, I don't really like, I got a cold vibe from her. She's kind of low key evil and this and that Which, see, I'm not going to like Megan. <laughs> I'm really not. I, I think that Megan is a cute girl. Um, but I, I'm really not going to like her. She's just really messy. Um, she, Megan had a meeting with Drea and they were sitting down and talking and Megan was basically, she told Drea pretty much how everything went, for the most part. Um, she's straight up and down. Um, that's one thing I will appreciate about Megan. But she's just, she's just mean and rude and real, real thirsty and for attention and for some kind of Twitter fame. Like it's really sad to see that such a pretty girl just is trifling. Like I wouldn't trust. I wouldn't trust Megan with my python. Let's just say that. Um, and they was just basically asking. Megan asked Jackie why she, Patrice why she was here. Patrice said because I'm you know I'm here to get to know Jackie basically. Um, when actually Patrice showed up because she thought the other girls was gonna be there, so it was kind of awkward thing or whatever. Because Patrice knows all the tea on Jacqueline because I'm sure Malaysia has told her everything. And so she was just like, you know, I know everything about you, but, you know, we can kind of make a clean, clean slate or whatever. I didn't see the first episode, like I said, early in this video, but y'all please fill me in. Because um, so far, I'm liking Patrice. What's the big deal with Patrice? Megan's just trying to start some shit. She's trying to create something out of nothing. Um, next week is going to be really interesting, though. It's going to start to get good. Uh, Megan's just finna be pulling shit out her ass the whole season, I'm sure. She's not gonna stop until she fist fight somebody. You notice where she comes from, Bad Girls Club. That's all they do on there is fist fight, drink, and sleep with each other. So we should definitely see um, about that. Um, I was just, uh, I can't get over how pretty Brandy and Malaysia is. Like, they are gorgeous to me. Like, wow. It's really, really pretty. Um, Brandy meets up with Jackie to talk, and that whole cancer comment, um, I did see that episode of last season, um, of basically Sunday and Jackie making fun of the fact that Brandy can't have kids, and the reason why she can't have kids, I believe, is because of her cancer, or, or whatever kind of illness that she has, or had, um, so they was kind of making fun of that, she was really upset about that, and, you know, I, I, I can understand that. Malaysia got so upset with Drea and Jack with Drea and 
Brandy, it's so many names, it's so many vaginas, it's so out of control. Um, and it's hot, it's hot as hell. Is it hot where y'all at? It's hot in South Carolina. Oh my God, it's so hot. It's just like 90s every damn day, I can't. Anyway, she got so mad, she was like, no. I said to have a date with Doug, not to have a meeting with Doug, and this and that, and Jackie, my husband has never met with another woman in over 20 years, and this and that. Jackie, ain't nobody think about that damn crouton, Douglas, please. My, she, you remember what she said, you saw what she said, though, y'all heard it. My husband has never met with another woman in 20 years. Y'all just, you know, read it in between the lines. Comments, all in comments. Allegedly, all this is alleged. So, you know, it's just, it's the fool. So they meet up. Damn Malaysia show up to the damn meeting like this. Bitch. Malaysia show up to the damn meeting like this. This is the spring collection. This is the summer collection. <laughs> Jackie outside in the car. It was just the fool. Basketball Wives LA is probably is gonna be a shit show this season. I can't wait. I'm here with you guys. I can't promise you guys that I'm going to give you guys the review on that night that it, that whatever episode that the episode comes on, but um I will definitely try my best to give you guys a review sometime in the week. Hopefully I can do it on that night, but you know, it just depends on my work schedule. But that said, I'm Mr. Chalaki. This is hot. I'm Mr. Chalaki on Google Plus. Follow me at is Kingsworth on Twitter. Chase King was here on Facebook at is Kingsworth on Instagram. And all that good stuff. I love you guys. I missed you guys. And I'm here. Stay tuned for more reviews and Chalaki news. Bye.